welcome back to my channel and today's video I'm so glad I got my hands on this palette it is the Nomad Cosmetics um, Royal Europe palette and here's just the outer packaging it's got a picture of the shades and then um, sorry, that was just like the uh, the box, the outer box that came in. And then um, it also had this cute little invitation card. Like you're being invited to a royal event. And it's just really, really cute. And then this is the palette. You guys, this packaging is, it's like cardboard packaging on the, on the back, but like the front, it's like a hard plastic. And just look at that detail. Here's the back of this. And I am just really, really, really excited. Um, I have one Nomad um, Cosmetics palette. I think it's like the Berlin palette, Back to Berlin or something like that. Um, and I really enjoyed it. I just, for whatever reason, I just haven't picked up any of their other palettes. And then I saw this one and I'm like, I have to have this. Like these jewel to tones are just gorgeous. So. Here is the inside of that palette. Just absolutely beautiful, stunning. Sorry, my husband just left and then I heard something upstairs. Um, so I think we're gonna, like, these duochrome shades on the bottom, let me try and just, if you guys can see the shift. I mean, I honestly, like, the indentation in the shadows is so pretty. Like, I don't want to screw it up. Like, I actually am sitting here feeling bad. Like, this is so pretty. I can't even use it. Like, I don't know what to do. Um, okay, so we're going to start. I think we're going to do two different looks. I'm going to do a two looks. Two looks thing, review, tutorial, whatever. Um, and I am zoomed in a little bit closer. Um, someone did make the suggestion that that would be a little better to do. It's hard because everyone sees things differently. Like, um, and also, like, I know um, this person, like, mentioned, like, me being so pale in the dark background washing me out. So I'm hoping this helps a little bit, um... Like, I know I, like, had a white background before, and then somebody was like, no, that's too light, and it just, it's hard. So, like, I'm trying to bring you guys the best content possible. Like, obviously, I'm new to this. I'm, I'm still learning, so thank you for being kind enough to give me that time to really learn and figure out what works best. I'm also, like, I have a very round face, and I feel like it's very disproportionate, so I do get a little self-conscious when that camera's, like, all up in my business, but I'm hoping maybe this could be a happy medium for everyone. Um, you know, and if not, you know, that's okay. I'm still going to keep trying to do what I'm doing and be the best that I can be at what I'm able to do. So with that being said, you guys, um, let's go ahead and get started. Um, the first shadow that I want to use, um, I really want to go in with the shade Pina Place, Pina Place, it's right there. Um, so let's go ahead and see what this shade looks like. Oh, and also my eyes were doing a little better, but I was outside today, so I feel like they're getting a little dry again. Um, I suffer from really, really, really bad allergies. And for whatever reason, it, it's so weird. It's only like messes with like the skin around my eyes. And it happens every year once it starts getting warmer and it literally stays that way until it gets like below freezing. So, um, yeah, that is what I'm dealing with right now. There was one video where I filmed, um, it's probably gonna go up after this one, but it was like so bad. Like you can see like a huge dry patch on my lid and like no shot like I had to put a shimmer shadow over it to cover it because it was so bad and it was nothing to do with the eyeshadow it was just my really bad allergies and dry patch okay so this is going on beautifully um I feel like I maybe I can kind of see a little bit of my dry patch just a little bit so 
Again, like that has nothing to do with the shadow and everything to do with me and my eye. But let's keep going. I think this is a really, really pretty shade. Like I, I like this. I like this. Um, now, shoot. What are we going to do next? What are we going to do next? Man, they're... Mm, let's... Hold on one second. Let's let me find a brush. That I can use. Alright, so I really want to go in with the shade the ballroom which is this shade right here i'm just gonna bring you guys in closer so you can see that detail hopefully it's gorgeous so for this shade we're just gonna put this on the outer corner You know, I think we're just going to bring this all the way in, but just the lightest amount on that inner corner. I promise there's a method to the madness. Okay, now... We are going to go in with the shade Royal Treasure, which is right here, which like has the coolest green pink shift. And we are going to put this on that inner corner, like Ooh. okay, this is really, really cool. Like, holy goodness. That is, that's really, really, really pretty. Very gorgeous. Okay. That is freaking phenomenal. Let me just do a little swatchy swatch on the hand hopefully yeah it's so crazy because it looks green and then it shifts to pink like can y'all see that shift hopefully you can see what i'm seeing It's just, it's really, really cool. Um, okay. That is so pretty. Um, let's do that lower lash line. Um, okay, so I kind of want to ever so gently, which we all know means it's going to be the complete opposite because this is me. Um, I want to take the shade Buckingham Palace, which is that shade right there, and I'm just going to buff that on the lower lash line. And now I want to take a 
the shade. Hmm. Blue de France, which is right there. And I'm just going to put that on the lower inner corner and actually blend that almost to the very end because that's just such a pretty shade. Um, let me go ahead and swatch that as well for you guys. And that is this shade right here. Can you see how cool that is? So yeah, that's a really, really cool shade. Um, there is some fallout. Um, hopefully you guys can see that. Again, not the end of the world. It happens. Um, but I know some people like make a big, you know, get really upset about it. It doesn't really bother me. It happens. Um, but there is some there I will have to clean up. But again, doesn't really bother me. These shades are amazing, beautiful no complaints here. Um, okay, so for the next eye, we're obviously going to go for a more blue-green look. And I want to start with the shade. Hmm. Let's start with King's Room, which is this shade right here. These shades are very, very, very pigmented, I feel like I need to say. I mean, you barely tap in and you're getting full color. Like, oh my goodness. And yes, there is some kick up in the pan, but again, like, that most shades have that. To me, it's not a huge deal. Um, here, I'll try and show you. Can you see that? There is a little bit. Um, it happens. Not the end of the world. Um, now I want to go in with the shade. Hmm. I'm going to go with Hall of Mirrors, which is this shade right here. And I'm kind of going to do the same thing. Um, I'm going to focus most of it on the outer portion of my eye, but then I'm going to gently bring the rest of it um, on the inner corner of the lid. And just gently bringing the rest of it in. getting Harley Quinn vibes right now <laughs> which is kind of funny um okay now 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 I want to which of these shades do I want to take because these are just freaking 
I want to do the shade Royal Orb, which is the shade right here. And then we're just going to do that on that um, inner corner of the eye just to see how it looks. I like it. I think it's very pretty, very, very cool shade. I got a little crazy and got a little too far over here than I would normally go, but this looks beautiful. Um, I'm feeling like a peacock right now. It's really cool. All right. That is cool. All right, so now for that lower lash line. Not so much fallout over here. I do find that purple shades give me more fallout for whatever reason. Um, hmm. Let's see. So I guess we're going to take the shade. My brush is running away. Um, Will Now Palace, which is this shade right here. And that's what we're going to put on our lower lash line to start out. And now, I am going to take the shade Imperial Crown, which is this shade right here, and we're going to do that lower inner corner, and we're just going to add it um, just a little bit into like the center of the eye as well, because that's what I did with the other eye, and holy crap, yes, that is so pretty, like, that's, I, I really like this, I really, really like this, okay, I am going to go put on my mascara and I'll be clean up a little bit of fallout and I'll be right back. All right, so I am back and this is the finished look, you guys. And I don't know, I just, I love this. I honestly, like that two weeks, I couldn't really do, um, or like week and a half, I couldn't really do makeup. I haven't filmed, I think, in almost two weeks, and it just feels really, really, really good to be back behind the camera, to be, sorry, getting a little emotional, um, to actually be doing something that makes me happy, because I, uh, Monday through Friday, I get none of that, um, so, like, literally my filming time, even though it only may be 20 or 30 minutes, um, I mean, don't get me wrong, like, when I do my makeup, you know, Monday through Friday, and I actually can do fun looks, like, that you know, brings me joy, but that's like 20 minutes. So yeah, life has just been hitting me so incredibly hard. Um, there's some stuff going on with my health that is serious and it's scary. And the only reason I'm telling you that is like, if there's maybe like a week or two where I don't get to post a video, um, it's just probably because I physically can't. Um, but I'm hoping everything will be okay. Um, in the future, I'm going to have to make a serious a doctor's appointment um, to see a surgeon. And things are really scary. But I hope that everything will be okay. So, um, you guys just seriously try not to cry right now. Because things have been so hard. But thank you for supporting my channel and for watching this video. Like you guys, it means so 
so much to me more than you'll ever know like I know I'm you know I'm just getting started at this but just to get to share something that I love with all of you um it just it brings me so much joy and um it's got me through some really really bad times and I hope it'll continue to get me getting me through the hard times because things don't do, seem to be letting up or slowing down so just thank y'all so much um I I hope that y'all are doing well just um yeah just remember that you're loved um you're amazing and i um i'll see you guys in the next one hopefully i'm gonna keep filming videos um but yeah just if there is like a little break in there um i promise if you know i'll be back as soon as i can there's just a lot going on right now and a lot of unknowns and it's scary but hopefully everything will be okay and I'll just be able to keep doing what I'm doing because I, I really do enjoy this and y'all just thank you. Thank you for everything and I um, hope you stay well. Have a good night, morning, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are and I will see you in the next one. In case this looks messed up, I got a little emotional and left out an important part of my outro which is this video was on the Nomad Cosmetics Royal Europe palette um here is the inside of this beautiful palette I am in love um I have nothing else to say like this palette is so pretty it's so much fun to play with um I really am upset that I missed out on their Haunted Europe palette um, so that's why when I saw this one and I fell in love, I was like, I gotta get it. Just a, sorry, hiccups. I get hiccups all the time. Um, just in case it's like a limited edition thing. So, yeah, um, hopefully my husband's able to put this in where it should have gone because I screwed up talking about stuff. But, um, yeah, so that's it. You're amazing. I love you. You're loved. Thank y'all so much for everything. Um, and, um, just stay tuned. More videos are coming and I'll see y'all later.